Hey everybody, welcome back to a new video. So Samsung is seeding out an update which allows you to remap the Bixby button on your Samsung Note 9, S9 and the S9 Plus. Now this update is available for users that are running the Android 9 One UI software. So first off, you'll need to update your phone to Android 9 One UI. Then after that, you'll get this update. And what this update does, it allows you to remap the Bixby button to launch whichever app you want. Okay, so to demonstrate, I've configured the Bixby button to launch the camera app whenever it's pressed. So if I press the Bixby button, you can see the camera app launches and then I can just use the volume up or down button to click a picture. I don't even need to touch the screen. And by the way, if you go to settings here, scroll down to shooting methods. Here you have the option which allows you to take a picture whenever the volume button is pressed. So that's another quick tip. But anyway, let me show you how to remap the Bixby button. So drop down the notification bar, go to settings, scroll down here to advanced features, and then tap on Bixby key. Here you have two options, single press to open Bixby, and now single press launches Bixby, and double press launches whichever app you set this option to. So I've set it to camera, double press, and the camera comes up. This is very useful if you use Bixby quite often, but I, since I don't use Bixby that often, I'll select the second option which says double press to open Bixby and I can just single press to open my favorite app. And if you want to configure this, just tap over here, then tap the gear icon and here you can select whichever app you want. So for example, let's select Instagram. Now if I press this, the phone will launch the Instagram app. Super duper useful, right? And alternatively, you can configure the Bixby Home button through the Bixby app itself. So first off, launch the Bixby Home, then tap on these three dots, go to settings, scroll down here and press on this option called Bixby key. Tap here and then here you have the same option. Single press to open Bixby, double press to open Bixby, uh, single press opens Instagram. So, so there you have it. So on my right, I have the Samsung S9 Plus and this phone has not received this update yet. So if I tap on these three dots here, go to settings, you have this Bixby key option. But if you go over here, you have two options here, press once to open Bixby and press twice to open Bixby. You cannot remap the Bixby button on the S9 Plus as of yet because this phone has not received the update. But don't worry, this phone will receive the update sooner or later. And just so you know, this update is a part of the February 2019 security patch level. So here we are in the software information and you can see I've got first February 2019 security patch level on my Note 9. Now my S9 Plus has not received this update yet. So it's still on the January 1st, 2019 security patch level. And if I go back here to advanced features on my S9 Plus, there is no uh, Bixby option here. So here's a side-by-side -side comparison of the advanced features menu. The S9 Plus has not got the February 2019 security patch level. So there is no big speak key option over here. Meanwhile, the Note 9 has got the February 2019 security patch level, which also brings this new uh, big speak key remapping feature. And if you haven't got the update yet, don't worry about it because Samsung will eventually update the security patch level. And that will also bring this new big speak key remapping functionality to your phone. And this is kind of very useful because I don't have to download any third party app on my phone. This feature is kind of built in now. And guys, I'm quite happy to announce that I pre-booked the Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus 128GB version. So this one should arrive by next week. I think it's coming out on 6th of February. And guys, honestly, I can't wait to get my hands on the new S10 Plus. And it will be quite interesting to see how the phone is like because we've got a camera cut out here on the screen itself. So yeah guys, stay tuned for videos on the S10 Plus and I hope this video was helpful. And finally, we can remap the Bixby button to whichever app you want. So guys, thank you for watching. Do stay tuned for more videos and I will see you guys next time.